What's up guys? Spartan85 here. Welcome to a 7 Days to Die mod called, I hope I can say this right, Prep Apocalypse. Prep you can't say it fast. Prepocalypse. <laughs> I was calling it Prepocalypse for a long time, but I realized there's two P's in the center, so it's Prep Apocalypse. Uh, it is the kind of the prepper style mod, so uh, survivalist. Uh, what the kind of the premise is is you're kind of a prepper, kind of a hoarder, kind of a you know doomsday prepper, and then the world ends. And so this is like right after you know the event, whatever you want to call whatever happens in seven days to die. So um, kind and there's a lot more like doomsday kind of survivalist POIs added. There's a lot more zombies added. Uh, there's the bigger backpack. You can already see right there the bigger, the bigger tool. Oh, they're about the same tool belt. Looks like not a bigger tool belt, but a bigger backpack. A lot of different items added. Um, but it's also still sort of close to vanilla, so I kind of enjoy that. A lot of stuff down here at the tool belt. Uh, prep starter kit. This will ease you. Yeah, prep op prep apocalypse. See, yeah, say that ten times fast. This will ease you back into the. the apocalypse and set you back on your path so let's open that oh it gave us a whole bunch of stuff all right there's wild rice there there's a wrench right here let's bring that down feathers a hunting knife uh, a pistol let's bring that down with some ammo with a scope and bacon and eggs with biscuits mm, that sounds pretty good actually a bicycle awesome i like mods that give you bicycles right up front and a crafting skill magazine bundle let's open that so we have improves electrical crafting we'll read that uh iv stand eliminate screamers read the this quest note and accept the challenge to place a prepper screamer stand and then eliminate a hundred screamers or an xp oh my god a hundred screamers we might save that for a little bit that's uh that sounds like one of the challenges that we got to do and i think war of the walkers or worth whereas uk did that one too there's spear crafting assault rifle and we can make a uh, pipe machine gun level two now uh medical crafting Whoop, wrong button read that handgun crafting Cool. We can make a pipe pistol level two. We already have a level two. Okay, stun baton bash hazmat. Read this quest note and accept the challenge to find and eliminate 10 stun baton hazmat entities. So they have stun batons? Oh, with a stun baton, I'm sorry. Uh, so when we have a stun baton, we can read that quest. Eliminate zombies. Read this quest note and accept the challenge to find and eliminate a total of 500 zombies over multiple stages. 10, 15, 25, 50. Earn XP. Uh, this quest repeats in an endless loop. So, like I said, once we have... That might be a good, like, horde base test or something like that. Read this quest note and accept the challenge to find and hunt animals over multiple stages. Earn XP, dukes, and two skill points upon completion. Uh, okay. I don't... Maybe I should read those. Prepper stockpile. Read this quest note and accept the challenge to restock. Follow the instructions to craft, collect, and place items in a progressive order. Let's read this one see what happens. Getting some basics in place. Okay. Cool. Let's knock out the initial quest. We need to make a stone axe. Let's do that real quick. There's our stone axe. Bring that down. Now we need to craft our plant fiber stuff. So there's our gloves, our hood pants shirt shoes okay so we'll wear the gloves i'm gonna scrap the hood because i did bring in a uh helmet light mod for just for lighting now we need to wear the oh we didn't we need to wear the hood oh darn it i always do that i forget okay let's wear the hood put the and what i normally do is i bring in the worst helmet that the the creative menu has and there was a level two military helmet i know military helmets are really good but it was the lowest level one that they had so okay we need to make a wooden club now let's make that we'll bring that down uh primitive bow and we can make some arrows we can make 25 which is the stuff they gave us which is pretty nice i like that they just give you the stuff right up front that's pretty nice uh, craft stone ammo. Locate the trader. Okay. We don't have to put down a campfire, I guess. Trader's right there. This is a random gen map. I am using the Seed Doomsday because I figured Doomsday Prepper is the show that was on 
uh, what National Geographic, I think, or something like that. Maybe that'd be fun to kind of try that out. See if I can get this rabbit. Oh, missed him. Hold still. It's only hurt for a minute. I don't know where he went, but there is a uh, deer up there, though. The rabbit's right there. Oh, the deer are fast in this mod. Man, look at that. All right, no deer for me. Whatever. All right, so where is this other... Let's go to the... Do, do I have some quest? Here it is. Campfire. So place a campfire, craft a campfire. That's the stockpile job. And then do I have any skills to burn? This is uh, learn by looting. I don't see any action skills or anything like that. So same at pretty close to vanilla. So that's all right. We'll rock that real quick. Let's go... Um, I'll always like to go Daring Adventurer. Oh, the Daring Prepper Adventurer. Risking your neck every day has its advantages. Gain access to better... Well, let's do that one. That's I like the Daring Prepper. Trying to see if there's anything mod-specific. Let's go Healing Factor. I like to go Healing Factor early because it does help, you know, especially early game. I haven't decided which way I want to go. I'm kind of leaning towards going Sledges this time since my last playthrough. I kind of went Clubs. Oh, Prepper Stash Hunter. For every seven blocks dug up, the treasure... Oh, that's the, so that's the treasure. They just changed the name, the treasure. Okay. Which I think that's what they maybe added. A lot more like Prepper Stash quest, which are like kind of the treasure, the treasure quest or something like that. I think there's a lot more in this alpha. Or this alpha, this uh, mod. Well, there is one called Prepper Strengths. Uh, the skill allows preppers to incorporate past strengths and gain accelerated XP. Uh, so basically you get more XP. Let's try that one out. I like more XP. All right. Uh, we are playing on Nomad just to kind of get our feet wet. I'll bump up the difficulty. Uh, everything hordes are every five days. So let's go Skull Crusher. Let's do that. And, uh, I'll find some stone. Can I go ahead and craft a stone sledgehammer? Yes, I can. Let's just craft a stone sledgehammer. Let's get that going. Let's go ahead and get our campfire going since that's part of one of the quests we need to do. Let's bring down our... Uh, sledgehammer. I'm bringing down our campfire. Everybody's screaming at me because I'm like, you have a bicycle, put it down. I know, there's my bicycle there. Okay, what's the next quest uh, on the prepper one? Gather cooking pot, gather raw meat, and gather eggs. Okay, that's pretty easy to do. Yeah, the only problem about having the bicycle early is you don't really find as many bird's nests. So I just need to keep an eye out for bird's nest, I guess, while I'm kind of riding around and not just run right over them. What is this? Wow. Is that the... Is that a POI on, on, out, on vanilla? It's like a... Uh, I think it is. I think that is. I think it's the one of the military bases, I think. Okay. Cool. Oh, I need to I need to kill this freaking deer. I need some raw meat. Uh I got somebody coming over. Hey, buddy. Um oh. I had to reload. Now he's at my bike. Okay, got to go. See ya. Ah, uh, there's the Navis Gang County Jail. Nice. I'm going to kill this deer real quick. Oh, he got away. All right, well, the deer got away. They are fast in this mod. They are freaking fast in this mod. So that's okay. That's, let's just go to the trader. I'll, I need to get some better weapons, I guess, because they are freaking fast. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I just suck. <laughs> let's grab uh, this bird's nest. We need to gather some eggs. There's an egg there. I think there's, oh, there's a piece of trash over here. Some stone. Cool. We'll grab that. This, this mod has been on my radar for a long time, though, because I do like the mods. Oh, there's a chicken right right to my, right next to me. Where'd he go? There he is. Hold still. This only hurt a minute. Oh, I think he got away, too. Hard to see him in the grass. All right, whatever. I'll deal with you in a minute. I don't know that the, they can harm the traitors in this, al in this... I keep calling it alpha in this mod. I don't know. I guess we'll find out here in a second. 
Let's uh, try to remember what trader this is. Is this trader Hugh? Maybe? The one that has the underground, possibly? I don't know. There's some food, though. Eat that, and we have a food crafting skill. Read that. We can make grilled corn and baked potatoes. Nice. Workstation crafting, and we can make uh, the dew collector now. Awesome. Another workstation crafting book. Thank you, sir. Uh, vehicle crafting. Nice. Uh, cooling mesh mod. We'll eat the food. That is corn seed. I'd like to try to plant that. I always say that, but I really would like to try to plant that. Can I throw the cooling mesh mod on anything? I could probably throw it on my helmet. Yes, let's throw it on that. Thank you. And here's the workbench here. More wood. Kind of thought, I mean, the mod said like it kind of like you're a, you're a, you know, you're a prepper and then you kind of cycle over to the apocalypse. So kind of interesting they don't give you like more clothing or anything like that to start off with, but that's okay. They give you the, the skills to make the stuff, which I, I appreciate that, like up front. So, which usually means if they give you that stuff up front, which usually means the, the game's going to be harder is kind of what it means, but we'll, we'll find out. Uh, vehicle crafting, more, another corn seed. Nice. Need to start us a garden. Oh no, it's uh, Everything it's wrecked. Sale. This is wrecked's place. I didn't realize this was wrecked place. Okay. Did not realize it was old wrecked. My buddy, buddy old pal. Where's this ladder go? I didn't know this was here. Does this go anywhere? Wrecked. What do you got up here, dude? Is this your secret stash? Ah, uh, some stone. This is where Rex sleeps, I guess. Or he brings home, uh, brings home his ladies. Ah, uh, what do we got? Suit jacket? We'll wear that. Sure. Why not? Okay, cool. What do you got for me, dude? Do you have any jobs? Clear zombies, clear zombie, bird supplies. Let's do the clear zombies. That's super close. Listen up, jackass. You jackass. Listen up, jackass. I love Rex. But it would be I'm going to sell this, uh, I sh probably should rock that scope. Um, I'm going to sell it for now. Give me some coin. Cha -ching. Thanks, buddy. Why not? I don't, I'm not a big scope fan on this, on this mod or on this game. I don't know. Well, the job is right over there. I hope it's surely not the jail, right? Although the jail would be a fun place to have a base. Maybe I could clear that out and rock a base there. Lieutenant Dan, I hear you. Please don't hit my ankles. I think he's stuck somewhere. Okay, uh, gas can. Okay. Just gonna ride over here and see what we have. That's a... I don't know what this POI is here. We got a brick building here of some sort. No idea what this is. Um, what is this? Is this the... Huh. I'm trying to figure out what this is. It looks it has an ATM on the side. Is it a... Whoa! What is that? Oh my god. Ow! Oh, it's a laundromat. Okay. I hear you, Lieutenant Dan. Hang on for a second here. Oh, the zombies are on jog. I should mention that too now that you see them jogging. What in the world? Okay, I gotta get my bicycle. Um, oh, there's a cop car here. We might hack into that, get some ammo. I gotta see what the heck this is. Now there, there, there are POIs like from the mo modded POIs added to this. What on earth is this? Is it like a ca Is it like a cave or it is a cave with a bunch of mushrooms? What? This is kind of cool. Oh, I hear a snake. Oh, my God. He's right there. Two snakes. 
Well, we'll definitely get a bunch of meat from this. Yes! Let's bring down our hunting knife. Who needs to hunt when you can just find the snakes like this? So I did read in the, that there are, like, survivalist kind of caves. So this must be one of them, I guess. Okay. What did I pick up, anyway? It was a barrel extender mod. What's up, girl? Anybody else? Does this go over here? Is this, like, all one POI? Bird's nest. Um, I don't know if it all goes over here or not. Oh, there's a safe. Oh, this is really interesting. Let's go over here and grab the stash, I guess. Grab all these mushrooms. What do we got? Repair tool crafting. Definitely grab all the mushrooms. Whoop. How far does... Oh, there's another... Oh, there's a bird. There's a bird. Get back. I think he's stuck. Oh, no, he's above me. There's another one. There he is. All right. Hey, Bernie. Yeah, you can just die. Is there another bird? Yep, there's another bird up there. I wonder if that's where the main stash is, like up there maybe? I don't know. Let's grab these birds though for the feathers. Definitely. Where's the other one at? Right here? And I did hear another snake too. There he is. Oh, there's two of them. Man, I don't like this. Alright, cool. Ow! Stupid bird. Oh, I missed. Stamina! I need stamina! Oh! Alright. This is a good place to die, apparently. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm liking this mod already, though. I'm loving it. Love it. How much meat did I pick up after all that? 50. That should be enough. So I just need some eggs now to complete that one quest. So I'm not finding very many eggs, really. Yeah, it looks like this might go back a little ways. There's lots of loot here, though. Oh, look at that. Nice. Beer. Oh, my God. Oh, there's something else. Where is the snake? There's Bernie there. Oh, a couple Bernies. Hey man, this POI is loaded. I can't get a good hit on him. Oh boy, this isn't good. Let me switch the bow for a second. If I can get it loaded correctly. You guys are fast! Goodness! Slow down! Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die pretty darn quick. Where's that stupid snake at? I hear him. Gotta be over here, maybe? Yeah, this POI is loaded with zombies. So I'm kind of, and I need to go do this job. So we might bail out of here. Oh, there's the snake. But if there's a bunch of snakes in here, this would be a good place to get some food. Definitely. I mean, this, yeah, this goes way back. All right. Ow! I don't like all the birds either. I mean, I like all the birds because I'm getting some easy feathers, but... Where are you? Stupid bird. He fl oh, they fly back. All right, let's get out of here. This is gonna, this is gonna be an all-day kind of thing. 
So let's get out of here. Let's go check out the job. We have four skills points to burn. I forgot I, I started with seven, so... I like this. That's a horde-based idea. Oh my god! Goodness, guys. I like this for a horde base, possibly. Oh, it's a passing gas. All right, we got a, we got a poppin' pills right there. Uh, looks like maybe a Shamway Foods. Oh, no, it's a Moe's, Moe's Power. It's like a taco truck. I'm really interested in the jail, though. Maybe clearing out the jail and using that as our, our main base. That'd be a fun place to do, like, a base. Or... What is that? Like, a, this is like the old Buzz's Bar, maybe? There you go. I got somebody else, too. Oh, Mo! You dead? Okay. Now, I did read in the mod that a lot of these zombies, and I, I, I'm I, guessing there's zombies added to this mod. I, I'm just guessing, but they're, they don't come till later. To the to the, uh, the you know the game stage is a little higher, so repair that, scrap that. Well, and we have this place here that's looks like the old Buzz's Bar, kind of is what it looks like. That's kind of cool. Well, it's already three o'clock. Let's jump into this job. Let's knock out this job. We might have to stay at the passing gas tonight until we can find another place. Uh, I like that too. Whatever that POI is, that's kind of cool. There's some cool POIs here. I like it. There you go. Take that. Uh, what do we have over there? Nothing? Okay, I need to either put some storage down or find a place to throw down my storage. I kind of like this. Maybe having that for a base a little bit. Um, I tell you what, let's make this our temporary base. This thing up here. Take care of Mo real quick. Let's go read these uh, books over here. What do we got? Uh, medical crafting. Uh, sledgehammer crafting. Yes, we need that. And electrical crafting. Cool. All right, let's hop up here real quick. See what we got to work with. I see something moving. Oh, it's a chicken. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, no, I want the other bird. Yes. Chicken. I don't know if he's part of the POI or he's just hanging out up here. Man, we have so many feathers. So we we'll be crafting some uh, arrows. This isn't... Alright, little bag up here. It's not much to work with, really. Handgun crafting and a club that we can bring down. Let's bring that down, get rid of our old one. Let's repair this one. Get rid of you. Okay. This will work. I could put some blocks down over here and kind of barricade ourselves in, I guess, for now. Let's throw down a storage crate real quick. Let's throw it down right there. I'm going to make as many stone arrows as I can, which is 91. Let's get those crafted real quick. Now oh, we have some stone arrows. Bringing everything else, I want to sell to the trader, of course. Hey, we'll go see the trader after this real quick. All right, I'll mark this on the map. This looks like a pretty decent sized city, though, that we're in. So this is pretty cool. I love spawning into cities like this. Let's see if we can knock this job out real quick. We kind of him hawed around a lot, and uh, but that's fine. It's day one. We do that a lot. Trying to figure out this mod. Some gas and some bone. Cool. And I tell you what, I have these skill points. Before I get too far, let's burn these skill points. Can we go Skull Crusher? No, we can't. Let's go into Strength. Let's bump that up a little bit. Let's go minor 69er. I tell you what, since we have so many feathers, let's go archery. Let's bump that up a little bit. And let's go advanced engineering so we can find some more workstation books. 
A little bit of lead. More lead. Some more stone. What do we got over here? Ah, Slim Shady. We got uh, No, I thought there was somebody moving over there, but it's not. It's just a sign. Okay, if you could die. Fantastic. Thank you, sir. Really appreciate your cooperation. Oh, boy. I got somebody coming. Grab this real quick. Harold. Man, I love the sledgehammer. I really try not to use it too much in playthroughs, but I just get oh, I get sucked into it, and I love it. So, all right, let's uh, activate this quest. What do we have here? Fertilizer. Be rotten flesh, right? Should be. Yeah, I'm not too worried about that right now. How do we get in this joint? Right here? Hello? Hello, nurse. All right, there we go. What is this, a clear zombies? All right, we can handle that. I think, right? There is a coffee seed. I'm going to pass on that. A little bit of iron. We'll grab this for the clay soil. Same one we just searched. Okay. A little bit more iron. Pick up all these. A lot of iron, I guess. There's some food. We'll eat that. Plastic parts. We're going to need that. We do have the dew collector unlocked. We just have to uh, find some plastic parts to make it now. So cornmeal. More clay soil. More lead. More cloth. A whole bunch of... Where are you? Oh, right here. Oh, Harvey. I call him Harvey. Uh, what do we got? Anything back here? That goes back there, which is our probably our next place we're going to go. Bunch of plastic parts here. Oh, missed. There we go. We have a ladder that goes up. Okay. Uh, harvesting tool crafting. We'll grab that. Bit of sand. I'm going to grab all these boxes for the plastic parts. We'll might as well stock up what we can. The quicker we can make that stupid dew collector, the better. Get some water going. Fair tool crafting. Cool. All right. The stone. We got somebody coming out of the bathroom. All right. Hey, some monies. Aloe vera plant seed, too. Okay. Got some more stuff out here to grab. Got some books. Give us some good. Repair tool crafting. Okay, we can make the claw hammer quality one now. All right. Need some forged iron for that. Which I see a vending machine here. Do you still get forged iron from taking apart vending machines? I really don't know. I don't know that I have time to really take it apart. Uh, yeah, we'll grab all that. Oh, there's a crate up here. Uh, seed crafting and a hobo stew, which we'll eat that here in a little bit. We can make cotton seed now. Joy. I'll be planting that as soon as I can. <laughs> uh, we're, oh, hazmat zombie. I haven't seen any, like, mod-specific zombies yet, so that's okay, though. But a food, a coffee, and, uh... Where is that? I don't know. I'm gonna drink that coffee real quick, though. I think they're right there, I think. Alright, whatever. Alright, seed crafting, some animal fat, and mushroom rice, which I have another one. It gives you lots of food. Lots and lots of food. All right, for sake of time, I'm going to skip the plastic parts. I got a bunch. I will. I can always come back here and grab more if I need. So I would like to get the, back to the trader and get my reward and pick up another job for tomorrow. 
if I can. So, paper. I want a mod that brings back toilet pistols. That's what I want. Yeah, I want a mod that brings back toilet pistols. <laughs> I'd just call it the toilet pistol mod. I don't care. Maybe there is like a small mod that does that. Just raise the chance of pistols being found in a toilet higher. That's all I want. Make that mod and I'll play it. Um, man, yeah, that's going to take forever to take apart, isn't it? That's actually going a little somewhat fast. We get plastic parts from this. Oh, yeah. Forged uh, steel. Oh, let's just take it apart. Screw it. Yeah, you still get forged iron and forged steel from that. Two and two, and you got some springs. So, yeah, taking apart vending machines is still a good idea in this game. They didn't nix that one, Alpha 21. Who's up here? Dead? I got somebody over there. I, McLovin hasn't woke up yet. See if I can kill his girlfriend without him knowing. Okay, cool. He's right there. Oh, I missed. There we go. Oh, he's moving fast. He's pissed off. They killed his girlfriend. Okay, where's everybody else at? I hear them. I think they're down below, though, I think. What I'm guessing. Oh, nice. Got some trash here. Everything's glitching out. Is this the main stash? I mean, we found a bunch of crates inside, so... That's okay. What do you get from, uh, you get plastic parts from scrapping this? No, you get iron. Okay. Pistol Whip Businessman, read this quest note and accept the challenge to find and eliminate 10 pistol businessmen with a pistol. Earn XP dukes and one skill point. So that's what um, they added, I read too in the, in the notes, was they add a lot more quests. And you kind of remember those from the old console version. You remember the, uh, uh, those are stealth boots we can craft. We'll read it. Uh, scrap the hood, scrap those. But yeah, they brought back quests, which is really cool, I think, because not that I did a lot of quests in the console version, but it is kind of cool. Uh, we gotta return back to the trader. Can I just drop down? Where's my bicycle at? Over here. But they're all very, like, specific quests. Like, you, you gotta kill them with a pistol, you know, so if I can just drop down here, there we go. Which I don't think a pipe pistol works for that. I'm just going to vent. I mean, it has a picture of a pistol. Maybe a pipe pistol does. Just not sure. Hello, old buddy. Congratulations. Sniper, volume one, 762 crafting Seven. skill bundle, mechanical parts. 762 would probably be good. Let's grab the 762. Need some ammo. All right, your next job is 316 away. Let's, Let's do that back. one. Good luck. And I got some things to sell you, brother. Can't sell the quest notes. That's okay, though. I'll use them. I mean, you get XP and you get a skill point from using them. So we have um, 977. Let me just see what he has real quick. Catfish. Yeah, there's catfish in this game. Catch a catfish in the fish trap or from a bear's mouth. Oh, that's cool. You can make fish traps in this game. Always wanted to try, like, fishing in Seven Days to Die. It just never has been a thing, really. Home cooking weekly, that's food crafting skill. Let's buy one of those. Oh, there's a cooking pot. Do I have enough for that? Yes, I do. Let's buy the cooking pot. Okay, that's good. All right, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Yeah, 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 shut up. And we'll read the book. Okay, let's uh, boogie back. Don't know what the knight brings in this mod. I don't think it's anything too crazy, kind of like, you know, the War of the Walkers or Ravenhurst, where it gets absolutely nuts at night. So, all right, we're back. And I just realized, I don't know how much, do I even have any wood to make some uh, stuff? I have 80. I need to grab some more wood real fast. Because I don't, I don't have any frames made to be able to fortify myself yet. <laughs> Running a little behind on this. Oh, there's a bird's nest. Yeah, I got 20 minutes game time to fortify myself up here. There's an egg. 
So, running a little bit behind here. Get up here. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. I don't know if I can even put down blocks, to be honest. Let's just see. Um, building blocks. Because I know they have these blocks. Okay, I can put stuff up here. Yay! Okay. Uh, how about right here? And right here? And then probably one up. Can I put one up here? Yeah, right there. And right there. Okay, cool. And then we'll take this out. Do the same over here. God, if somebody comes right now, I'm so screwed. I mean, I'll fight them, but right there, right there, right there, right there. Upgrade these. Anybody will be able to break through this real quick. I mean, this is nothing. Need to make some cobblestone rocks as soon as I can. All right, let's make a door. Two of them and hatch. Two of them. And we'll bring down the door. Put one door right, if I can put it on that other side. Eh, it's not going to let me, is it? Okay, we'll put the door right there then. That's fine. Put the other door right there. Bring down our hatches. Boom. Boom. Okay. We're somewhat <laughs> sportified. Can I make any cobblestone rocks? Just... Well, I can make 48. That's not bad. Let's just do that. Let's make some cobblestone rocks. All right, we'll have that upgraded for now. That's what we'll do. Place down a campfire. We have a cooking pot now. We'll throw that up there. Cool. And probably not much we can... Oh, there's a caught chick. Use two caught chicks with right mouse click on an empty chicken coop to populate. Oh, you can make chicken coops. Just like Darkness Falls. Oh, that's so cool. I'm loving this mod already. That's great. Yeah, I'm loving this mod. I love the extra added things. That's, that's really cool. All right, cool. All right, well, I'm going to just throw the stuff in the inventory real quick and probably see what I can cook up. Probably not a lot. Um, I can eat one of these mushroom rices. I'll eat that. But, yeah, we're going to have to make another storage box, too. Looks like it. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. This is a fun mod. I'd like to make this into a series. So if you want to see more, please let me know, and I'll make this into a series. Really appreciate it, guys. Catch you guys in the next episode. See ya. Mm -hmm.